Welcome back. Here's hot Michelle. Michelle who has a hot back. Yes. I corrected myself. You're going to lean in on your stomach for me, okay? Okay. So the way we adjust that thoracolumbar junction is we have a specialized table. Liam, come under the table for me here. See this knob? I'm going to flick it. And did you see how this table dropped? Now it's open, right? Let your arms hang to the floor. You're going to take a breath in and out. Lift your head. Good. Right there. And now that's moving nicely. And so that is a really stress-free adjustment. Did that bother you all? No. Was it easy? Yes. Yeah. To adjust the thoracolumbar junction. We open up that abdominal piece so it takes the slack out of the spine. We lift the head, which even reduces more slack. And we get a little bit of a thrust, a little bit of an impulse. Spine moves, joint relaxes, muscle calms down. Do you want me to adjust your lower back today too? Or do you want to wait on that because you had the shots? No, I would like to have my back adjusted. You can do that. So let's go on your side face, people. Okay. In you go. Great. So if there's any scouts out there that are looking for a model or they like <laughs> Michelle's voice or her looks, just leave a comment to this video below and we'll get her involved in your Hollywood production. So I'll just, I'll get you guys in touch, okay? A little push here. Good. Other side. And this top way. Let me bring this hand down a little bit. There you go. A little push. There you go. Oh, on your back. That was nice. Yes? insurance question. Do you guys know that we take most major insurances? Blue Cross, Aetna, United Healthcare, John Hopkins, EHP, and Medicare. Let your hips relax. We also do out of net, some out-of-network Cigna benefits. Good. Who do you have? Blue Cross? Yes. Yeah. We're network, we're network Blue Cross, Blue Shield, all the blues, Blue Choices. All right. There's a little tune-up for you guys. Yes. Good. I feel great. Love it. All right. If you guys have any questions about how we take care of different spots, on your back, shoes, shoe fell off. <laughs> Sorry, shoe fell off. <laughs> we got a wardrobe malfunction over here. Um, leave a comment below. As always, thanks for watching. And we'll see you next time. Michelle, thank you so much. Thank you, Dr. Blake. So did you know that October is National Chiropractic Awareness Month? No, neither did we. So in honor of that, we are going to talk about some really interesting facts about chiropractic and then throw that over your favorite adjusting clips. Have fun, enjoy, and if you have any questions, please reach out. Chiropractic is widely recognized as one of the safest, drug-free, non-invasive therapies available for the treatment of neuromusculoskeletal complaints. All 32 pro football teams use chiropractors to help keep players healthy and in the game. Chiropractors treat musculoskeletal conditions such as neck and back pain, hamstring and quadriceps strains, whiplash injuries, and more. For football players and others who need a clear head, chiropractic non-drug approach can help diminish the need for prescription pain medications. There are more than 70,000 chiropractors in the United States who are required to pass a series of four national board exams and be state licensed. There are approximately 10,000 chiropractic students and 18 nationally accredited chiropractic doctoral graduate education programs across the United States with 2,500 chiropractors entering the workforce every year. In 2017, the American College of Physicians released an update to its low back pain treatment guideline that recommends first using non-drug treatments such as spinal manipulation, a centerpiece for chiropractic care, for acute and chronic back pain. Chiropractor's collaborative, whole person-centered approach reflects the changing realities of healthcare delivery and fits well into accountable care organizations and patient-centered medical home models bring greater clinical efficiency, patient satisfaction, and cost savings. Chiropractic is also safe for children as well as pregnant women. Nine out of ten Americans suffer from headaches. Some are occasional, some are frequent, but most of them can be helped by chiropractic. 
If your first approach to managing pain or symptoms, whether it be a headache, low back pain, or neck pain, is grabbing a pill bottle or taking medication, try using conservative care like chiropractic to help manage and get to the root of your symptoms. It's important to understand that chiropractic care is included in most insurance health plans, including major medical plans, workers' compensation, Medicare, sub-medicated plans, and Blue Cross Blue Shield plans for federal employees. Hey everybody, thanks for watching our video and I hope you enjoyed the facts about chiropractic. If you guys have any questions about how chiropractic care can help you, please leave a comment to this video. As always, thanks, thanks for, for watching. watching. Hi everybody, it's Dr. Blake from Kelstein Chiropractic, your Baltimore area chiropractor. We've got Brittany in the office. Brittany, hop up here for me. On your side, face that way. And we'll lean in. So Brittany started coming to see us three visits ago for some back pain. Um, and we've got you feeling better, haven't we? Yes. Are the exercises hard? No. They're easy for you? They're not easy, but they're not super challenging. They're not super challenging. So we're going to upgrade your exercises. Okay. All right. Bend this top leg. So Brittany came in. We did a full exam on her. We looked at her lower back, her muscle strength. We found out that she had, we've got to strengthen your core. We've got to loosen some of the muscles up. And we've got to, we're going to adjust you to take pressure off the joints. So we started around some core exercises. Right now, Brittany says they're a little too easy, so we're going to up them next time. And then we put some ice and stim on our lower back to calm some of those muscles down. And then we're going to adjust your lower back. We're also, let this drop here. There you go, other side. She also said today, oh, I'm glad my neck feels a little tweaked, you know? And we have no problem switching the way the therapy's up, switching the exercises up, switching the adjustments up based on what the patient is telling us today. So we're actively listening to you when you come in. My next little tweak, we're gonna put some therapy on your neck and your lower back today, or we're gonna adjust everything on you today. All right, good, on your back, please. So I've, had, I've always heard patients say, I'm going to physical therapy and I have a script for knee pain, but my back hurts too, but they can't work on my back because the script is for knee pain. Mm -hmm. We have no problems for that here. We'll work on anything that you tell us that hurts. For the, for the most part, I'm gonna put an asterisk there. <laughs> Within our scope of practice, there we go. A little tense up there, huh? Mm -hmm. And there too. Okay. Here, here. Let the left shoulder drop. Good. Shoulder drop. That was really good. So when I ask her to let her shoulder drop, just a little bit of a relaxation technique. As soon as I feel that muscle relax, I adjust. All right, let's roll over and get your upper back, okay? Yeah, Brittany's really being extra quiet for the video. I don't know what's going on. Normally she's loud. It's almost like not borderline obnoxious how loud she is. I'm just kidding. So. Relax, just let your arms relax. Take a breath in and out. Good. Good. Good adjustment today. All right, there's a full spine adjustment based on the complaints that Brittany had today. Right? Yeah, yeah. thank you. You're welcome. If you guys have any questions about how we treat multiple regions, leave a comment below. As always, thanks for watching, Brittany. Thank you. You're welcome.